This is the sign in question, an advertisement for the pro gun club painted on the side of the mountain. And some think it's an eyesore. I'd gotten some calls, I'd received some calls from uh, some residents, some citizens, some of my constituents. Clark County Commissioner Steve Sisolak came out to view this sign, which sits on privately owned land to determine what action, if any, needs to be taken. When it's your own property, you have a bundle of property rights, and there's certain things you can do and certain things you can't do. So is the sign within the rights of the owner? Sisolak says yes, within a certain size limit. Now, I don't know if this exceeds that or not, and we'll have to do a calculation to determine if, in fact, it does. The debate is whether or not the sign is an eyesore. The owner tells me that so far it's brought in customers, which brings in money, which allows them to hire more people, hence boosting the local economy. It's the whole idea to create jobs. Owner Pete Elitis says he never wanted to upset anyone, just bring in some business, and it's worked. Every day somebody comes, you know, I, I came because I saw the sign. Elitis said he did receive complaints and removed some of the sign, which previously displayed open to public seven days with the telephone number. The best thing to do is to listen to people. Uh, and that's what I did, and we took it down. But Sisolak says complaining about the sign isn't as important as recovering the economy. If they can do something to create, you know, 20, 30, 50 jobs, I'm all in favor of it. Chris Delcamp, Fox 5 News Local, Las Vegas.